Ring Wrestling fans, Matt Topolsky here for the National Wrestling Alliance with another exciting contest tonight from NWA Houston. The World Heavyweight Championship on the line as Ray Rowe gets his shot against the Tokyo Monster, Kahengus. It's a matchup Ray has been waiting his entire career for. Tonight, he gets the opportunity to wear that 10 pounds of gold. Accompanied to the ring tonight by the beautiful Samantha Rowe. Ray Rowe training for weeks for this matchup. Getting himself fit for battle here tonight. Ray Rowe, a tremendous athlete, originally from Cleveland, Ohio, made the trek to Houston, Texas. And has been making quite a name for himself here in the Lone Star State. But this is a man who has been making a name for himself across the world. And excuse me, ladies and gentlemen, not a man, a monster. The NWA World Heavyweight Champion, the Tokyo Monster, Kahengus. Kahengus may have bitten off a little bit more than he can chew tonight. We're going to find out, but Ray Rowe has been on a streak as of late. A huge victory just a month ago over the near 400 pound killer Brent McKenzie. In a lumberjack match widely regarded by many as a match of the year candidate. But the Tokyo Monster Kahengus is a beast. There's no question about it. And tonight we've got a real treat on our hands folks. The style and martial arts background of Ray Rowe versus the brawling tactics and martial arts background of the Tokyo Monster, the World Heavyweight Champion. We go to Tony Brooklyn for the official introduction. Ladies and gentlemen, the following match is for the NWA World Heavyweight Championship. First, I will introduce the challenger. He hails from Cleveland, Ohio. He's now fighting out of Houston, Texas. He's, a, he's accompanied to the ring by Samantha Rowe. He weighs in at 221 pounds. He is Ray Rowe! The biggest match of his life tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, he is the defending NWA World Heavyweight Champion. He hails from Japan. He weighs in at two. 125 pounds. He is the Tokyo Monster, Kahagas! The Tokyo Monster. This fall, this match, Since November the 2nd in Clayton, New Jersey, this man has been world heavyweight champion. Many men have stepped up to the plate. To date, no one has taken that title from Kahagas. Could Ray Rowe be the guy? For all the marbles here tonight. The World Heavyweight Championship right there. The most prestigious title in the sport of professional wrestling. Scott Zenzen checks both men and the bell rings and this one officially begins. trying to get the crowd behind him. Certainly a hometown feel for a man who has taken to Houston, Texas, and Houston, Texas has definitely taken to Ray Rowe. In the mind 
games continue. champion, a huge mistake for Rowe, and the Tokyo Monster takes advantage. Kahagas is a devastating force in professional wrestling, and tonight Ray Rowe is going to need everything he has, a knife edge chop in the corner, and another one. You will not find a harder puncher, a harder jumper, or a harder kicker in this business than that man, the world heavyweight champion, Kahagan. Reversal there from Rowe. Ray Rowe fires back. Knife edge chop of his own. And another one. World Heavyweight Champ. Not allowing Rowe to build any momentum here. Pacing around that ring and trying to break the momentum of Ray Rowe. for this moment. And now he'll try and get this NWA Houston crowd behind him again. Ray Rowe trying to rile up this crowd. Oh, and he baited in the Tokyo Monster that time. Knife edge chops in the corner. Right hands now from Rowe. Devastating knife edge chop in the corner. And here comes the Tokyo Monster again. Kahegas beating him down in that corner. Physically imposing his will on Ray Rowe. Club to the back. And now a kick to the head. And another one. And Ray Rowe could be concussed right there. Two count and no. And now Kahangas going to work here. And now a choke between the ropes here, Bunk Kahangas. Samantha Rowe trying to help her man. And this crowd to get behind him and a kick to the temple there from the Tokyo Monster. Ray Rowe wanted this matchup. He was chomping at the bit for an opportunity to wrestle for the NWA World's Heavyweight Championship. But be careful what you wish for. The Hangus, another big knife edge chop right here on a different level right now. Block from Rowe and here he comes back. Another shot from Ray. The Hangus wisely gets back into the ring. And a boot there once again. And now putting that boot on the back of the neck of Ray Rowe. Come 
And now a stomp from Cahagas. And another kick to the head. Brutality at its absolute finest from the world's heavyweight champion. Another knife edge chop. And an elbow. And another elbow. And this is Cahagas' backyard when you let him brawl in there. Reversal from Rowe. Into the buckle. Meets another elbow. And now Cahagas with that inadvertent choke. The legs around the neck. And the damage has been done. Big club across the chest. Oh my goodness! And what can be said that hasn't been said already about the Tokyo Monster? Absolutely devastating. Rowe desperately pulls himself back into the ring. No matter where he finds himself, he's in no man's land right now and a near fall right there. The official almost counted him down for three. Cahangas back USA, to work. Rowe trying to feed off this crowd. USA, Elbow USA, underneath. USA, Coming back, shoots off the rope, but meets a boot to the head right there. And at the outset of this contest, I talked about the striking ability of the Tokyo Monster on display here in another near fall. Ray Rowe took it down deep just to survive. Now the Tokyo Monster back on top, cutting off that air supply for Ray Rowe. Rowe battling, trying to get back to a vertical base here. Rowe underneath and a kick. And now another kick to the chest. And another one. And another one. And here comes Ray Rowe. Oh, but a devastating clothesline. Turns the challenger inside out. Covered by Cahagas, two and no! Two and nine tenths right there. Official Scott Zenzen almost counted it out. And now stretching that abdominal area, the shoulder and the neck of Ray Rowe. Cahagas has done the damage and now he is trying to capitalize on every piece of it that he has done. Does Ray Rowe have any gas left in the tank? Rowe fights back. Irish whip meets another boot to the head. Beautiful suplex right there from the world's heavyweight champion. And Ray Rowe doesn't know where he is. Pure instinct to reach for that bottom rope. Ten minutes gone by the match, 10 minutes. And the longer this beating goes on, the worse things become for the challenger. Snapmare takeover. Oh, it drives that knee into the top of the head, into the skull of Ray Rowe, and that could be it. No! And you've got to believe that if the champion had hooked the leg there, that could have spelled disaster for Ray Rowe. A nonchalant cover keeps the challenger in the matchup. Rowe battling to get back to a vertical base. Not going to happen here. 
The Tokyo Monster applying that pressure. Shots in the abdominal area and a cover. Almost got him again. And you can see it becoming more and more difficult for Ray Rowe to kick out with each pitting opportunity for the World's Heavyweight Champion. Tokyo Monster throwing some leverage behind that. Samantha Rowe yelling on in support of Ray, whose hand goes down once, goes down again, and one more time, this one will be over. No! Ray hanging on. How is he doing it? What has he got left? Rowe trying the battle to get back up to his feet. Boot to the gut from Gehegas. Irish whip, reversal from Rowe. Ray Rowe catches him. Beautiful belly to back suplex right there. Rowe beats him. And another time, one more. Cahagas back with an offense chop. Rowe responds with one of his own. Cahagas coming back. Rowe coming back. These two are testing the limits of human physicality, testing each other's intestinal fortitude right now. Double D into the corner at signature Ray Rose. Rose pulls him out for the cover here. And Cahagas' arm was under the bottom rope. Now a cover. And that delay may have saved him right there. The first. Solid bout of offense right here. Wait a minute! Death row from Ray! He got it! He got it! Go for the cover! One, two! And Kahekis got the hand on the bottom rope! Pure instinct from the world's champion! Or we would have had a new champion crowned here tonight in Houston! Cahagas pulling himself back up. The challenger charges into the corner but meets the boot. Oh, and Ray, a bit overzealous, sent face first into the middle turnbuckle. And Cahagas now. Oh my goodness, signature chops in the corner. And Ray is being tenderized here. Kahig is treating that ring like his own personal butcher shop. And now he's calling for it. He's put away a lot of challengers with this. Reversal from Row. Ray, death row one more time. No, reversal, Cahagas shoots underneath, folds him up like an accordion, and it's academic. Cahagas retains the title. Ladies and gentlemen, your winner, and still, NWA World Heavyweight Champion, the Tokyo Monster, Cahagas. An incredible challenge to the World Heavyweight Champion tonight from Ray Rowe. But it was not enough. On this night, the Tokyo Monster Cahagas is still champion. A 
physical beast. But you have to tip your hat, ladies and gentlemen, to Ray Rowe, who put it all on the line out there tonight. He fell short, but he pushed Kahangas to the limit. Samantha Rowe coming to the aid of Ray Rowe, just a little short here tonight. But you've got to believe he'll get another shot at that world's title sometime in the future. It's only a matter of time for Ray Rowe. Ladies and gentlemen, let's hear it for Ray Rowe! Wrestling fans, thank you for joining us for this special presentation of a World Heavyweight Championship matchup from Houston, Texas. Stay put where you are. At the conclusion of this broadcast, a special announcement from the NWA President R. Bruce Tharp and NWA Vice President Chris Ronquillo, along with a special guest in regards to Parade of Champions on April 20th. For the National Wrestling Alliance, this is Matt Topolsky. City, USA, Paul Bosch presents Wrestling Spectacular, matching the world's top wrestlers in fierce competition. It's going to be seven matches, top to bottom, uh, a star-studded card. The best way to honor the legacy of Paul Bosch is what we are doing on April the 20th. You know, the, the only way that you can honor Paul Bosch is to put on a wrestling show the way Paul Bosch would do it. It is going to be an action-packed, star-studded card that no one will want to miss. Make your plans to be there. NWA is back, and Paul would be proud.